Good afternoon, dear traders. Good afternoon. It's me, Anna Kasatkina. And me, Olga Vitkovska. You're watching InstaForex TV economic news channel. Find out the combined review of Forex and stock markets for the last week. Could you tell us about the American dollar dynamics, Anna? The US dollar declined versus the euro on Friday. What reasons for such trend can be named? News about joint work of Spain and the European Committee related to the plan of economic reforms, which can help the fourth largest economy in Europe to cope with recession. The euro strengthened to 1 US dollar and 29.89 cent, having increased from the level of 1 US dollar and 29.68 cent hit on Thursday. Still, the euro remained in the minus zone, having declined by 1% weekly after the information that the US FRS is intended to buy another portion of the American debt. The dollar index ICE fell on Friday to 79.323 pips from the gauge of 79.428 pips reached on Thursday. For the week, the indicator sank at 0.6%. Financial Times cited the unnamed resource informing that the European Union and the authorities of Spain are developing a new pack of economic reforms for Spain, which can be revealed this week. The reforms are aimed at fulfilling conditions of the international creditors, after which Spain can count on the financial support in the form of the ECB buying the Spanish bonds on the secondary market. At the same time, the American dollar decreased against the Japanese yen and the pair was trading at 78.12 pips after last session mark of 78.26 pips. Weekly, the greenback lost 0.45 percent as the Bank of Japan expanded the asset purchase program to 80 trillion yen. The analysts from BNP Paribas consider that the American currency will continue weakening amid the FRS asset buying program implementation until the moment the FRS sees the signs of the U.S. labor market recovery. That's all I have by now. Thank you for the review of the currency market, Anna. You're welcome, Olga. How did stock markets behave? The American equity market was demonstrated ambiguous behavior on Friday. And what influenced the market performance? News from Europe regarding a possible aid pack to Spain and also the market launch of iPhone 5. Thus, the shares of Apple up moved by 0.6% after the launching of the global sales of iPhone 5 with huge queues. Moreover, because of the rush around the latest iPhone, the shares of Apple rivalry Research in Motion lost 3.4% when the producer of smartphone BlackBerry announced service disorders in Europe, Mid-East and Africa. At the same time, the shares of fast-food restaurants McDonald's gained 0.6% after the company had increased the quarterly dividend by 10% to $0.77 cent per unit. The outpayment is due on December 17 and will be allocated to the shareholders who were registered as of December 3. Thank you, Olga. You're welcome, Anna. You were watching the weekly review of the Forex and Stock Market presented to you by InstaForex TV team with Olga Vitkovska and Anna Kasatkina. Have a nice trading week. Goodbye. Goodbye.